Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have a very, very big thrifting haul, like bigger than they usually are because I hadn't gone in like weeks and y'all know that my, well I don't know, how am I talking about this? My thrift store like has so, like it literally every time I go the shelves are overflowing and it's all different stuff. Like I almost never see the same thing twice. So yeah, there's a big turnaround in the toy section. So they always have tons of stuff. So every time I go I get tons of stuff. Um, I'm just like, cause like sometimes I'll go every week and sometimes I'll go every few weeks, but I haven't been in a few weeks and I went and I found so much good stuff. So without further ado, let's get into this. Now first I'm going to get into these bags of like random things. Basically they just throw a bunch of stuff in a bag and sell it for like two or three dollars. And normally whenever I get these, there's only one thing in the bag that I want. So a lot of this is probably going to end up being donated back cause I need to reduce clutter, but let's open it. Okay. This is a bunny. Why does this look build a bearish to me? It's from Kelly Toy, which is the same company that makes Squishmallows. Uh, but yeah, it's just like a printed little bunny. Cute, I guess. Looks kind of wintry. Um, oh, and this is the reason I bought this. It's because of Gen 1 bow tie, which I actually already have, but my bow tie doesn't have a tail. And this one does. So yeah, very squishy. Um, so yeah, my little pony right there. Where do I put you? Let's see what else. <gasps> okay, I didn't even know this was in here. This is so cute. It doesn't work, but it's a like a Tinker Bell flashlight. Like little Disney fairy flashlight. Hmm. I wonder if I could put more batteries in it to make it work. And a Disney Princess Aurora flashlight. Do these people just like have a thing for flashlights or something? I don't know. Uh, and then this fake mini camera. I don't know if it's supposed to turn on. I don't know. A lot of the stuff also I'll just end up giving to like children that I know. Because what else am I going to do with it? Um, let's see. Okay, let's look into this bag. Um, one of the sequined Thai Beanie Babies. Um, Judy from Zootopia. <gasps> okay, this is really cute. Who is this? Tucker. The Thai Beanie Baby. Okay, I kind of love him. You know what? You get to go. You get to stay. Because the only reason I got this back, because it was like a dollar, is for this little Winnie the Pooh. For Because I just love Winnie the Pooh so much. So I saw that and I was like, oh, he's so cute. He's flat. I need him. Um, What the? What is this? I don't know what this is. I'm not keeping that. That looks haunted. Uh, and then this little like rattle thing. Um, okay, let's look at the next bag. Oh, this bag I feel like is gonna be very exciting. This bag was expensive. This was a six dollar bag. So it better be good. I saw some Disney and some Hello Kitty, so let's bank on that. A Jesus a Jesus loves me bear. I don't need that. Okay. Uh Minnie Mouse. I actually already have a mini like this, but mine is a rattle and this one isn't. So I can put I have a whole pile of like Minnie and Mickey plushes. Um, another baby toy. I don't know any babies. Adora the Explorer. <gasps> oh my god, this is adorable. It's French mini. I wonder if this is from Epcot. Globe trotting French Mickey. Oh wait, no. Mini. It's Mini. I'm dumb. I can't see the year. I'll look it up later, but this is adorable. I love it. Yeah, because I collect Minnie and Mickey plushes, just because they're like the most versatile Disney plushes. Um, and then a little, a little mini. I actually have the big one of this, I think. And then this one's like a keychain. So yeah, both of these. Um, this one's definitely like American Girl doll size, so I might just put it in my pile of AG stuffed animals. But it's so cute. So yeah, I'd say that bag was worth. Okay, um, I think this is my last mystery-ish bag. Ah! What just fell out? I do not know what brand this is. <gasps> yes! Um, a Gen 1 baby pony. I think this is a Gen 1 baby pony. I could be wrong. Um, I mean, it is definitely a Gen 1 My Little Pony, but I don't know if they're like babies or whatever, but cutie. I've had a lot of luck with My Little Pony recently, which I'm happy about. Um, I think this is a Barbie pet. The tag's been cut off, but yeah, that's, that's definitely Barbie. I don't know. I'll keep you. Ah! I feel 
like it's looking into my soul. <sighs> um, looking at this brings me major deja vu. I think I had this whenever I was younger. I think I'll keep you. Um, let's see what else. More random toys. A jump rope. I don't jump rope. Oh, it's a little, one of the McDonald's mentees. I feel like I've been avoiding this for so long. Because every time I see one of these, I'm like, no, I want the, I want the normal mentee. But she, I guess she's cute. I guess you're cute. I'll keep you. Because I love mentee. Okay, now we're going to get into all of the loose things that I bought. Or things that I bought that are in bags, but I know what they are because they're singular. Because sometimes I just put things in bags if they can't easily, like, put a tag on them. Okay, so the first thing, oh my gosh, this is so cool. Ah, it's a calico critter house. It's missing the door um, and a few other parts, but still, like, a calico critter house is crazy. I got it for $2. Um, so, yeah, that's amazing. And then this is also something I'm so excited about. My Little Pony Nursery. Okay, let me just open it up before I show you because it's wrapped in plastic. So yeah, I'm so excited for this because literally in like my last haul video, I think I got, um, I got the, one of the little like baby gen three ponies. So let's see. Now she has a place, a place to be. She has a house, a little house. Honestly, like I've always thought this was so cute, but I'm like, I'm not gonna, I don't want to spend a lot of money on it, but I got it for like, I think $3 or $4. I don't know. But yeah, it's very cute. Um, yeah, look at that. I wish I had a nursery like this when I was, I was a baby. And then like, there's the floor. It has a little My Little Pony thing on it. But yeah, this is just like so adorable. I'm sad I didn't find any more baby ponies, but I'm cool. Because I have the little Pinkie Pie one, so this is going to be hers now. Good for her. Good for her. Um, let's see. Ooh. Winnie the Pooh. Got him for $3, but he's so soft. And I just, I'll, I buy literally almost every Winnie the Pooh plush I see. Because I am so, I just love Winnie the Pooh so much. A lot of these are going to go through the wash after this video. I have a special laundry bag for them and everything. Oh no. Oh wait. How did he get all the way over there? Okay. Another Winnie the Pooh plush. Little graduation Winnie the Pooh. Love him. From 2001. That's crazy. And he's from the Disney store. They always have a bunch of Disney store plushies and stuff at mine. Oh, and then for 45 cents, I got this little Christmas Winnie the Pooh. Um, oh, and this is the one I was most excited to get. Halloween Winnie the Pooh. I've been wanting this specific plush, but he's always like expensive online. So, and he has like the tag still. Like most of these have the tag still. That's crazy. Like, look at him. Squish, squish. Um, let's see, what else did I get? Oh, Disney Princess Clock. Like, it was $8, which is kind of expensive for me. I don't think it works, but it's very cute. It's very cute. Uh, so, I had to get it. Like, I probably could have waited and it would have been cheaper, but I don't know. I don't know when we're going to go back, so I grabbed it. <gasps> okay, these are very fun. Calico critters! So, um, upon some, you know, research in the car, some very, like, you know, not good research, I just looked up brown calico critters, and then I saw them, and I was like, yep, those are, these are the, the timber top brown bear family. So, I don't remember all their names, but yeah. So, I'm assuming this is who the house belongs to. Uh -huh, look at them, look at them. Also, my mom got a bag of calico critters that I didn't see because we were both in her store and we like buy things separately. Um, so she got that bag. She said I could pay her for it. So I'm going to just steal them whenever she's not paying attention because she doesn't care that much. And I think the brown bear baby was there and I want him. Okay, also there's this, this Santa one and his beard is like rooted. So he's like meant to be Santa. I don't know. He's kind of cute. I saw him online and he seemed to be going for a lot. So but I'm keeping him. I love Christmas and I love calico critters. This is their home. They live here now. Okay. So yeah. 
Um, oh, more calico critters, but these aren't like calico critter, calico critters. They're like the extras that are animals that I guess aren't sentient in the calico critter universe. Honestly, I'm not sure. But they're the horses. And I actually have like a baby horse. So these can be his parents, I guess. Yeah, each of these bags was like six dollars so all of those were six and then all of these two and then i also got little baby ducks but not like sentient ducks so, look at that oh my god oh my god like they're so cute i love them i love them i'm sorry i'm sorry that i'm like this but they're so cute they're so little little babies and then, where's my baby horse? At least I think this is a baby horse. Horse, mother horse. No, father horse, mother horse. Baby horse. Yes. Yeah, I love calico critters. I've been collecting calico critters since I was like little. Okay, what else? I don't have that many other things, but two of them are things for my girlfriend. So if you are my girlfriend and you're watching this, stop. Back up. I got her the little heart Webkin's frog. Look at him. He's so happy because I love her. So I got him because he's cute and he's only a dollar. So you go in to wash with the other ones. You all gonna get a bath. Okay, I also got this, which was just really funny. It says, build a book of memories, girlfriends. And then it says, a keepsake of friendship. And I was like, that looks gay as fuck. I mean, frick how we came to be words to describe her likes dislikes most memorable meal like all this is so this is gay so i had to get this it was like a dollar 65 and i'm like this is adorable this is so adorable i can't wait i'm gonna She's probably not going to watch this video because I don't think she really watches my YouTube videos because she doesn't really like dolls. No hard feelings. But I'm probably going to take this to her house tomorrow and I'm going to make her do it with me. This is so cute. Um, let's see what else. Okay, this I was kind of confused about because it was in the kids section and I was like, that doesn't look like a kid's. Well, it does, but like, I found these. And like, at first glance, I was like, okay, um, so it's just like a kid's extra large. But it's a kid's small well no it's not a kid small it's a small and I'm like this is obviously an adult small so I was like this is obviously adult clothing and also it's cute so I'm getting it you know bones bats I love all that stuff um so maybe I'll wear some color and then I also got this dress it was like three dollars just skulls and flowers and stuff that's cool Oh, and then two more things in the thrift store. I got, I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. But you know what, this is such a good haul. Like, bro, ow, I just punched myself. <laughs> okay, Aurora doll. She's naked, but she has like my favorite Aurora face mold. So I want to get another Aurora dress and put it on her. You know? Oh, she has the bend and snap means I hate those. But yeah, um, she has my favorite Aurora face. What year is she from? 1999? That's old. But yeah, she's my favorite Aurora face. I don't like the current Aurora's face. So I want to get like a nice, high quality Aurora 12 inch doll dress and put it on her. And then, okay, this is another one that I'm so excited about. Like, oh my god. This is such a good deal. I paid $6 for her, but like... Disney animator Rapunzel doll. I love Rapunzel and this is just like okay she's she could use some loving but look at her she has her freckles and her big green eyes and her face is very dirty but like she's so cute I love the Disney animator dolls and I'm so happy that I finally have a big one of one of my favorite princesses that's so good okay a few more things I want to show y'all that weren't from the thrift store um because I also went to Target and I didn't feel like making a whole other video. Well, actually, I got a doll. And I'm going to make a whole other video for that. But I got two other things from Target today. Okay. And they were both on sale. 
<laughs> I got new sheets because I have my Vampirina sheets, but I've had them like forever and I want a change. And these frozen fantasy ice cream sheets were on sale and I was like, those are cute. I wanted just plain pink ones, but they didn't have any. And my mom was getting my sister sheets and she was like, do you want new sheets? And I was like, these are cute. Frozen fantasy is just a dramatic name though. Like for ice cream, y'all really probably have to wash these too before I put them on my bed. But, and then I also got this shirt. This shirt. I got it for $6. It was originally 20. Um, I don't know. It just seems very dark floral and I don't have a lot of dark floral clothing, but I like flowers and the color black. So I grabbed that since it was super on sale and if I don't like it, oh well. And that brings us to the end of the video. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.